Ever wondered why cancer, a condition that was once rare is now so common? Could it be because we overlook the early signs? We live in a fast-paced world where our health often takes a back seat. But what if we could catch a potentially life-altering disease like cancer in its early stages? What if we knew what signs to look out for? It's not about creating fear, rather, it's about empowering ourselves with knowledge. Knowing the early signs of cancer could be the difference between a minor health scare and a major life challenge. And while we're not saying that every cough or skin change is a red flag, being aware can help us make more informed decisions about our health. So let's dive right in. Let's demystify, decode, and debunk some common misconceptions around this disease. Today, we'll be exploring eight early signs of cancer that everyone should be aware of. Starting off, our first sign is unexplained weight loss. Ever lost weight without trying? It might seem like a cause for celebration, but hold off on the confetti for now. When your body is fighting an illness like cancer, it can cause a phenomenon called cachexia. Ever heard of it? Well, cachexia is a complex metabolic syndrome associated with underlying illness and characterized by loss of muscle with or without loss of fat mass. The weight loss is an involuntary response to the disease. To put it in context, let's imagine this. You're not on a diet, you're not hitting the gym harder than usual. And yet the numbers on the scale keep dropping. That's unexplained weight loss for you. So if you're shedding pounds without an explanation, it might be time to have a chat with your healthcare provider. So remember, unexpected weight loss might be more than just a pleasant surprise. Before we dive in further, we have a quick request. You see, we're on a mission to share groundbreaking health knowledge with as many people as possible. And guess what? By subscribing to the Air and Vitality channel, you're not just supporting this mission, you're becoming an integral part of it. So go ahead, hit that subscribe button. Let's continue this journey of discovery together. Remember, knowledge is power, and by subscribing, you won't miss out on any future videos we post. Moving on to our second sign, skin changes. Have you noticed any changes in your skin recently? Cancer can often manifest itself through alterations in our skin, the largest organ of our body, these changes can range from new growths or sores that don't heal, to alterations in the color, size, or shape of existing moles. Let's consider an example. Suppose you have a mole that you've had for years but suddenly it starts to grow or change color. That's a flashing red light right there. It could be a sign of melanoma, a type of skin cancer. Now, don't panic. Not all skin changes signal cancer. Many are simply due to aging or exposure to environmental factors but it's crucial to keep an eye on any noticeable shifts. If you're in doubt, seeking medical advice is always the best course of action. Remember, your skin can tell you more than you think. Next up, our third sign is bowel habit changes. Ever experienced persistent changes in your bowel habits? This might be something more than just a reaction to that extra spicy burrito you had last night. You see, our bodies are like finely tuned machines and persistent changes in bowel habits can sometimes be a warning sign of a more serious condition, like cancer. Cancer can cause changes in bowel habits by affecting the digestive system. This could be through a tumor blocking the bowel, or cancer cells disrupting the normal functioning of the digestive system. For instance, a person might notice they're experiencing constipation or diarrhea more often, or perhaps their stools look different than they used to. Now it's important to remember these changes can also be caused by a variety of other conditions, not just cancer, but if you're noticing persistent changes, it's always a good idea to check in with your doctor, so always pay attention to your body's signals. Our fourth sign is a persistent cough. Have you been coughing for weeks now? It's not uncommon to have a cough that lingers after a cold or flu. However, if you've been hacking away for weeks or even months, this could be a sign of something more serious. Lung cancer, for instance, can cause a persistent cough as the cancer cells irritate and narrow the airways. The cough might be dry or it could produce phlegm. It may even cause discomfort or pain in your chest and throat. Let's imagine our friend John. He's been coughing persistently for a couple of months now. Initially, he brushed it off as a lingering cold. But when the cough didn't subside, he wisely decided to consult his doctor. So if you or anyone you know is facing a similar situation, don't hesitate to seek medical attention. Remember, a cough that doesn't go away might be saying something important. Sign number five is unusual bleeding. Have you ever noticed any unusual bleeding? This could be a sign of an underlying condition, including cancer. When the body's cells multiply uncontrollably, it can lead to the formation of tumors. These tumors can damage surrounding tissues and blood vessels, causing bleeding. For example, blood in your stool or urine or bleeding between periods for women 
could be a sign of colorectal or bladder cancer, or uterine cancer respectively. It's important not to jump to conclusions at the first sign of unusual bleeding though. Many non-cancerous conditions can also cause this symptom. Nonetheless, it's crucial to get it checked out by a healthcare professional. Remember, early detection is the key to effective cancer treatment, so don't ignore these signs. Always keep an eye out for signs that something isn't quite right. Your body is a complex system and unusual bleeding can be its way of signaling that it needs help. Next, sign number six is a lump or thickening. Ever felt a lump that wasn't there before? It's a common symptom that can signal the presence of various types of cancer. This is because cancer cells tend to multiply at an abnormal rate, forming a mass or a lump that can sometimes be felt through the skin. These lumps or thickenings can appear anywhere on the body. And while they're most commonly associated with breast cancer, they can also indicate other cancers such as testicular or skin cancer. Consider for instance a scenario where you're applying lotion and you suddenly feel a lump on your arm that you hadn't noticed before. It's important not to panic, but to get it checked out. Remember, not all lumps are cancerous, but it's always better to get professional medical advice. In the face of cancer, knowledge is power. Stay informed, stay vigilant, and remember, early detection is key. Our seventh sign is difficulty swallowing. Have you been having trouble swallowing lately? It might seem like a minor inconvenience, but if this issue persists, it could indicate something more serious. You see, when cancer develops in the esophagus or throat, it can cause a narrowing of these passages, making swallowing a challenge. For instance, consider the story of Jane. She was a healthy woman in her 40s who started experiencing difficulty swallowing. At first, she dismissed it as a common cold. However, when the problem persisted, she sought medical advice. Tests revealed that Jane had esophageal cancer. Thankfully, because she paid attention to this subtle sign, Jane was able to start treatment early and is now in remission. So, remember, while it's easy to brush off such a symptom as a little more than a nuisance, it's critical to listen to your body. Never ignore persistent difficulties. Finally, our eighth sign is changes in moles. Noticed any changes in your moles recently? Well, it's time to pay attention. Moles are usually harmless, but a change can be a sign of melanoma, a form of skin cancer. Melanoma can cause moles to change in size, shape, or color. They might even become itchy or bleed. Let's take an example. Say you have a mole that has been the same for years. Suddenly you notice it's getting bigger or changing shape. Maybe it's not a perfect circle anymore, or perhaps the color has darkened or lightened. It's these shifts that shouldn't be ignored. But here's the good news, folks. When detected early, melanoma is highly treatable. So keep an eye on your moles and any changes they might undergo. It's not about being paranoid, but about being proactive with your health. Always remember your body is constantly communicating with you. And there we have it. Eight early signs of cancer. We've journeyed together through this important discussion, unraveled medical jargon, and boiled it down to simple language. We've illuminated the shadows of the unknown, casting light on the path to early detection. A path that can potentially lead to better outcomes and healthier futures. These signs, unexplained weight loss, skin changes, altered bowel habits, persistent cough, unusual bleeding, lumps or thickening, difficulty swallowing and changes in moles, are not to instill fear, but to empower you with knowledge. And knowledge, as they say, is the first step towards action. We're all in this together, navigating the vast ocean of health and wellness. Your experiences, your thoughts, your insights, they all matter. They contribute to this dynamic conversation, this global effort to stay informed and keep each other safe. So what about you? Have you noticed these signs in your life or in the lives of your loved ones Remember, it's not about self-diagnosing, but about being vigilant and proactive about your health. If you have any concerns, always reach out to a healthcare professional. Your journey, your story, could potentially help others. So we encourage you to share your thoughts and experiences in the comments below. Let's keep this conversation going. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Aaron Vitality. Stay healthy, stay informed.